الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم رب اشرح لي صدري ويسر لي امري واحلل عقدة من لساني يفقهوا قولي رب زدني علما اللهم وفقنا في الدين امين سو وي ور ٹاکنگ اباؤٹ سورۃ الاشورا کنسلٹیشن چیپٹر نمبر 42 اینڈ اٹس ا مکی سورہ اینڈ وی سٹارٹڈ دا آیات حامین دس از ون اف دا حامین سورہ and uh, after that it says ain seen half so kazalika yuha ilaika wa ila allazina min qablika allahu azizul hakim so here allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says that allah the almighty the always sent his revelation to muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam he sent to those before you so try to focus on the wordings of the quran kazalika thus likewise yuha is from wahi and i explain you different type of wahi ilaika to you ka is a pronoun and ka is towards you means rasul allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam so this wahi revelation uh, revealed towards rasul allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam wa ilal ladina and those before mean qablika before you so allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is saying before prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam also we have sent revelation to different prophets Allah is Aziz and Hakim and Allah is mighty and wise there are two attribution of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the end of the ayah number 3 Aziz and Hakim so in this ayah ayah number 3 we have seen how the revelation comes and this revelation is not new for Rasul Allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam it has been revealed before Rasul Allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam different prophets and also to prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam This is the way of Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala every time you know telling Rasul Allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam about the previous prophets and here the sifat of Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala Aziz and Hakim mighty and wise and soon after if lahu ma fi samawati wa ma fi ard wa huwa al-aliyul azim lahu only for him ma whatever fi in as samawati wa ma fi ard in the heaven and in the whatever in the earth wa huwa and he al ali the most high exalted and al azim the most great so have you seen before it was aziz al hakim but here ali ul azim ali is exalted and azim is most great everybody knows the asma ul sifat right 99 attributes of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala ar rahman ar rahim so with the names of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala we ask allah whatever the dua we do okay and here we are talking about what allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has made lahu for allah subhanahu this pronoun has been used for allah subhanahu wa ta'ala whatever is in sky and earth he is the one who is high above and and he is very great see the wording ali is high and azim is great he is i high and also he is great and remember this this is for this dunya and also for the akhirah this world and the hereafter sakadu samawati yatafattarna min fawqihinna wal malaikatu yusabbihuna bihamdi rabbihim this ayah is very nice rabbihim wa yastaghfiru liman fil ard ala inna allah huwal ghafurur rahim here i'll translate it Can translate this ayah first. The heavens might have almost broken apart from above those who are elevating Allah's creatures to this rank. If the angel would have not been glorifying their Rabb with their praise and begging forgiveness for those on earth. So here, let me explain this ayah. This is very nice and especially for us, it consoles our heart. Takadu samawati yatakfarna. it is almost near that it will yata fatarna is from fatara to break something so why it is like allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is saying it will break or fatara you know complete breaking so here allah subhanahu wa ta'ala don't like like because of the highness he is ali and ali azim you know um, in uh, one surah it comes if this quran has been revealed on the mountain it will go inside the how great the kalam of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala the words of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so this is how the quran is because of the greatness of this kalam because of the highness of this 
تو لائک ہیئر مطلب اللہ تعالیٰ بتا رہے کہ قریب ہوتا کہ سماوات پھٹ جاتا اسکائی ہیئر وی سی اونلی ون اسکائی رائٹ وتھ اور نیکڈ آئی بٹ دے آر سکس مور رائٹ سو ہیئر یو یو کڈ سی بیکاز آف دس یو تو فتر نا اٹ ول بریک ون مین فوق ہن نا اباؤ دین فوق ہن نا اٹس اباؤ فوق ول ملائی کا تو یو سب بھی ہوں نا بھی ہم بھی اینڈ یو نو ٹاکنگ اباؤٹ یا تو فتر نا بریکنگ دا اسکائی بٹ سون آفٹر اٹس ٹاکنگ اباؤٹ یو سب بھی ہوں نا ول ملائی کا یو سب بھی نا ہونا اس کا تصبی ملائی کا تصبی کر رہے ہیں یو نو یو سب بھی ہونا ملائی کا ملائی کا آل دا اینجلس آر ڈوئنگ تصبی تصبی آف اللہ سبحان اللہ تعالیٰ سو ہیئر بی ہم دی ربی ہم بی ہم پریزنگ اللہ سبحان اللہ تعالیٰ ہم ربی ہم دے آر رب آور رب دیز اللہ سبحان اللہ تعالیٰ و یس دا فیرونا دس از دا کی تھی یس دا فیرونا از فرام غفرا دے آر سیکنگ آسکنگ فار گیونس اللہ سے غفرا معافی مانگ رہے ہو اینجلس آر آسکنگ فار گیونس فار ہوم دے آر آسکنگ فار گیونس سیدھا آیا لی من فل آر فار دا پیپل ان آرٹ فار آرز سبحان اللہ وین آئی وین ایور آئی ریڈ دس آیا آئی فیل سو کنٹینٹ ان مائی ہارٹ so peace in my heart subhanallah angels are meeting to are like doing astaghfar and also you sab bhi huna you sab bhi huna we know like angels jo hai na tasbeeh bayan karte we know everybody but they are doing tasbeeh as allah is asking forgiveness for the people on the earth so here we have to understand this some of the mufassir they say asking forgiveness angels they are asking forgiveness for all the people one point of view but other says no it's not so they are asking forgiveness only to the people who believe wa yastaghfiru liman fil ard this is the thing you know whenever you feel sad try to focus this surah ashura ayah number 5 wa yastaghfiru liman fil ard who is asking yastaghfiru na you sab الملائکت سو دس از دا تھنگ نو آئی ایم سینگ وی فیل کنٹینٹ ریڈنگ دس لائک یو نو اینجلس آر مین دعا فار اس سم ٹائمس وی فیل ویری سیڈ رائٹ وی فیل لائک یا ہوپ لیس اینڈ دیٹ ٹائم وی شوڈ ریڈ دس آیا سو دیٹ آئی نو یقین یو نو دیٹ کنٹینمنٹ ان یور ہارٹ اٹ کمس او اینجلس آر آسکنگ فار گیونس وین وی ڈو فار گیونس واٹ وی تھنک او وی آر لائک یو نو ہم بہت گناہ گار ہے وی تھنک وی آر ویری سمپل پیپل اینڈ وی آر ڈوئنگ استخ فر اللہ بٹ وین وی سی دس آیا وی تھنک او اینجلس آر میکنگ دعا فار اس دے آر آنرنگ اس دے آر گیونگ آنر ٹو اس سو دے آر ہیلپنگ اس ڈیفینیٹلی so this thing makes our heart more convinced that allah will forgive us okay but in forgiveness sincerity is first thing you know later on in other ayah also it will come yastaghfiruna and up how the uh, forgiveness will be there so forgiveness there are the few things we have to take care of but here angels are not coming and asking you but they are making to up because amanu wa amilu salihat only thing iman and the amal saleh even though we are doing amal saleh we keep on doing mistakes i don't say sinful things because as a muslim we don't want to do that sinful thing let me explain sinful things also asima isma isma from asima asima is that that kind of camel with which like deliberately walk slowly even though it can walk fast so sin is is that kind of sin which we are deliberately doing it which we are not supposed to do it so are we doing that no we are not we are trying our best it's not that i'm not saying uh, literally are we doing that we check ourselves right like um, for example being mean to somebody or being jealous Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But we realize, and soon we ask forgiveness to Allah and also to our children. Even though we are elder and 
Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has given us position, we never felt like, you know, asking forgiveness to our kids. Can't we feel like, you know, even to the smaller ones, whenever we do wrong, we feel bad and we ask forgiveness and there is nothing wrong. I felt even like, you know, we are grown up, mashallah, even our parents does. Sometimes they are very, you know, as we said, doing the nasiha, mostly our parents does. My parents does. And later on they realize and they say, like, yeah, I was, you know, very rude or hard sometimes. They do. Because sometimes we are very stubborn for something, you know, we think this is the good deed and this is the only way. And they keep on saying, no, no, there are more ways. You are affecting your health or something. You know, they are more concerned towards us. That's how we are concerned towards our children. And we keep on saying them and they say, no, you are mean to us. We don't mean to. So here, يُسَبِّهُونَ بِهَمْ بِرَبِّهِمْ وَيَسْتَغْفِرُ لِمَنْ فِلَدْ أَلَا إِنَّ اللَّهَ هُوَ الْقَفُورُ الرَّحِيمُ Allah is like a beware. And inna beshad johan bolte na, indeed. Allahu Allah huwa hi alun al ghafur al rahim. Most forgiving, most merciful. Why this attributes? Ghafur and rahim. Because he is forgiving. Angels are asking forgiveness. And now listening to that, we, we all are saying, Astaghfirullah, Astaghfirullah. Allah, please forgive our sins. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is saying, I am ghafoor and I am rahim. Without the rahmat of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, we can't enter Jannah also. You know that? Even though we have so many good deeds and everything, we have to cross the pulsarar. That time also we need raham. If we did something wrong to someone, they will stand and they'll ask, oh, no, give my good deeds. So raham. And that time Allah will give the rahma, raham. He is rahim. And here, Ghafoor, we want forgiveness. And this Ghafoor and Ghafara is such kind of forgiveness, you know. Just say, Urdu mein bolte na, dhaap lena. Ek maa kya kati, dhaap leti, you know, answer mein. Us tarah se, Ghafara is like a helmet which covers. So, sins are covering. Okay? But sometimes we talk about Af, that is wiping out. Here, Ghafara is forgiving. So, here, Ghafoor Rahim. وَالَّذِينَ اتَّخَذُوا مِن دُونِهِ أَوْلِيَاءَ اللَّهُ حَفِيزٌ عَلَيْهِمْ وَمَا أَنْتَ عَلَيْهُمْ بِوَكِيلٌ وَالَّذِينَ and those اتَّخَذُوا they made min from دُونِهِ besides Allah awliya close protecting friends Allah Allah حَفِيزٌ protecting guard عَلَيْهِمْ upon them وَمَا أَنْتَ and not you عَلَيْهِمْ over them بِوَكِيلٌ any وَكِيل or disposer here you have to understand this وَالَّذِينَ اِتَّخَذُوا They are the people who are making other deities as their God. See the translation of this. Those who take others as their guardians besides him, Allah himself is watching them and O Prophet you are not the disposer of their affairs. Some people اِتَّخَذُوا They take دُونِهِ اَوْلِيَا اَوْلِيَا is from Wali. They are taking their close protecting friend more than Allah. You understand what I mean? Sometimes maybe some person on shrine is dead and we keep on asking that person even though he is not anymore. Or some scholar apart from Rasulullah Wasallam, some four uh, scholars are there and four aima. Some people they exaggerate things and they exceed the, you know, degree of them more than Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Have you noticed that? I came across many people. They say, no, he is awliya Allah. He can do this. He don't have to do the wudu so many days. I said, I never heard of it. I know Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi That's it. I don't want to see the other avenues, what the people say. Because our memory is very little, like, you know, I don't want to put so many things in my memory, which, you know, sometimes we have to do the spam. Mm-hmm. And we have to delete the things. Better to delete the things which harm you. If you put so many things in your plate, it will spill. Same thing with your memory. Putting so many things in your memory. Sometimes, you know, small things, try to remove that. Like, you know, day to day, what we are wearing, what we are doing. We don't put in our memory. Have you noticed that? We put the things only which are necessary, which are important. That only, and we try to regenerate that thing. 
again and again. So same thing, here, awliya Allah, there is no awliya Allah, there is no uh, supernatural thing, okay? We believe in one God and we believe last Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he conveyed the message in 23 years, the Quran has been revealed. So no awliya Allah. Hafizun alayhim. Allah Ta'ala is guard over them. Wama anta alayhim bil wakil. Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala is telling to Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, just, you know, convey this message and you are not disposable. You are not, you know, if they are doing wrong, you are not responsible. You don't have that responsibility that you will be asked. You understand what I mean? He has that so much in her, in his heart, he feels bad for the people. Like when he is conveying, for example, uh, people of Makkah, hmm? they believe in other deities. They believe in Allah. Everybody should remember that. They believe in one Allah. Whenever the, you, you remember when they are going in ship and they are saying, Oh Allah, save us. <coughs> but they ask other deities. Like other deities, have you noticed like when they put the idols and they do the, Oh God, help us and this. And these days, wherever you go, they have this Christmas tree and the Son of God and they are praising and they are saying, okay, uh, Santa will help. This is supernatural. No Santa is there. Our Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, ask me in later on in this, we'll see the ayah where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, yes, the jabulahu. I will answer. We know we don't need like Christmas time and that time, you know. So here, just mm-hmm. convey the message. Everybody, we have to just convey the message. We are not responsible for anyone, okay? But we are responsible for our ra'i, like for our family, for our spouse, for our parents too, if they are going in the wrong direction because they don't have that much technology that time. Give 70 excuses to our parents or to our siblings. If they are going on the wrong path, Tell them nicely. Same thing, Nasiha, what we have learned today. So we're going to tell regarding religion. So, وَكَذَلِكَ أَوْحَيْنَا إِلَيْكَ قُرْآنًا عَرَبِيًا لِتُنزِرَ أُمُّ الْقُرَى وَمَنْ حَوْلَهَا وَتُنزِرَ يَوْمَ الْجَمْعِ لَا رَيْبَ فِيهِ فَرِيخٌ فِي الْجَنَّةِ وَفَرِيخٌ فِي السَّيِّرِ Here, thus have we revealed to you this Quran in Arabic. Quran and Arabian. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is saying to Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, we have revealed this Qur'an in Arabic. Why it was revealed in Arabic? Because Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam speak Arabic. Whatever those prophets speak, those language it was like Musa alayhi Islam and other prophets. So, litunzira, what is the reason for it? So that you warn. Litunzira, li for tunzira is from Nazara. To warn people. This is the reason behind it. Ummul Qura to the town, mother of the uh, city. That is Mecca. Ummul Qura. Waman hawlaha around it. Scholar says it's not only Mecca, all around it. Whether it's China or India, it doesn't matter. For you know, that time only, it says Sahaba, they went very far and they spread the Islam. But many other religions, they say, no, our religion is so and so and started spreading that idols and those. No, our Islam, they spread it. But Islam, you know, don't have any deities or anything. Simply, just now what we did? We did Salah. But do you feel peace in your heart? Otherwise, if you don't do Salah and we keep on doing this lesson, you know, you have that thing. I have to do Salah, I have to do Salah. You know, that kind of thing, that restlessness, that's moment. That's the believer. When they do the puja and whatever they pray, they, they do or they pe- keeping free, does this give happiness? I don't think so. Many people in, uh, you know, African American or have you seen how they convert to Islam? Especially in prison. Uh, we have seen that WhatsApp, uh, some of the messages also. How people are converting. Why? They are getting time to think. Okay, this is the life. This is the Islam. And you know, they are understanding what it is. Alhamdulillah. So, يَوْمَ الْجَمَيْ لَا رَيْبَ فِي فَرِيْخٌ فِي الْجَنَّةِ Here, for them, the day of assembly. 
Matunzira, first tunzira, warning. Then yomal jama. Jama is like jo jama hona murdu mein bolte na, same thing. Jama is gathering. Everybody will gather. La raiba kihi, there is no doubt. Koi shak nahi hai, koi doubt nahi hai. Parikhan fil janna. Some people in janna. Okay? A party of them in janna. Wa parikhan fil sair. Some in the hellfire, blazing fire. So here, no doubt, when some will go to paradise and others to the blazing fire. So we have to make dua. Allahumma inni asalukal jannatul firdaus. Auzu billahi minan naar. Every time, no matter how busy you are, ask this dua. Anna Allahumma inni asaluka. Me sabal karta hu ya I ask you, I beg you. Asaluka kill janna. Enter me in janna. Jannatul Firdaus. Auzu billahi min al nar. Please save me from the fire, from the hellfire. Hellfire is so bad. Like when we open the oven, how we feel it. Oh, this is so much heat. Can't bear it. You know, that's all. Later on, the next time. Walau shallah ala jaalahum. So here two parties are there. One is Jannah and one is Sayyid. But here, you know, one hadith comes. In that it says Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam, everyone will be shown Jannah and Jahannam. Jahannam. I have read the ayah, um, hadith about Jahannam, but I am not sure about Jannah. I have to check uh, double time because I have read about Jahannam. Everybody will be shown about the hellfire. This is the place in the hellfire, even though you are going to Jannah. So here, so we all pray to go to Jannah. Walau shaallah la jaalahum. Ummatun wahidatun wala kinna yudhkhil al-mayyasha fir rahmatihi wa zalimina ma lahum min waliyum wala nasir If Allah wanted, He could have made all of them a single nation. Allah can do it easily. Make everyone single nation. Okay? But He admits to His mercy whom He pleases. It means what? He gives this mercy to whom He pleases. We are blessed to have this rahma of Islam. To be on the right path. As for the wrongdoers, they will have no protector and helper. But well, zalimina here zalimin who are zalimin? Those who are doing shit. Those who are asking other than Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. Maalahum min waliyu wali. Just now we discussed close protecting friend. No close protecting friend. No one will save you. People must be thinking, oh, that only Allah will save me or some somebody or the other. No, even close friend no. Wala nasir no helper. You know, in dunya, I think, word, we want some help. Somebody may help you, friend or anybody. But that moment of time, no. So later, Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala, they set up other guardians besides Him. Why Allah alone is the guardian? Am itta kazu min duni hi aulia. Again, the ship. They are like you know, other than Allah, they are taking the guardian. This word aulia, this is third time, again. Am itta kazu min duni hi aulia. Fallahu huwa waliyu. Wahua yuhi yuhiel mauta. Wahua ala kulli shayin sabi. So here they set up other guardians besides him. Means besides Allah. While Allah alone is the guardian. He is only wali. For all of us. Hasbi Allah huwa neeman wakhi. When Ibrahim al-Islam he was put in the fire. That time he was saying this. And Allah protect. So we always, when we are going through bad phase or anything, Hasbi Allah wa Nimal Vakil. You know, nobody can do anything. You know, we are making wali, like he is the wakil, he is protecting. So he will guard you. Wahua yuhi, so it is who gives life to the dead. So giving life to the dead is a big thing, right? In the whole world, anyone can do that? No. Wahua ala kulli shayin khadir. He is who has power over all things. So here he is the Shayin Qadir. He has that Qudra. He has that power to do that. O Prophet ﷺ, tell them, whatever the subject of your dispute is, its judgment belongs to Allah. Such is Allah my Rabb. In Him I have put my trust and to Him I turn in repentance. So here, whatever, وَمَا قَلَفْتَهُمْ Khalaf is like you know, any difference. I may have difference with anyone. Okay? 
halaktahum fihi min shayin anything any different wa hukmihi so its decision is ila allah for the allah zalikum allah rabbi alayhi wa tawakkaltu but i trust allah i do tawakkul on allah wa ilayhi unib and repeatedly in repentance so here prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam tell them whatever the dispute is between them okay its judgment belongs to allah there can be dispute between people for us also there can be dispute and there can be difference of opinion but the ultimately the things belongs to allah such is allah my rab and in him i put my trust and to him turn in repentance again talking about repentance and here we are talking about unib unib it's, it's from now repeatedly turning you know yastaghfiru astaghfar is you know giving for, uh, giving the forgiveness but unib is you know keep on you know trying it even though once you did mistake and again you are doing unib from now and ibrahim al islam you know he was, he was unib he was keep on going towards allah subhanahu wa taala so here fatira samawati wala again the creator of the heaven and earth he has made for you made from among yourself talking about how he has fatira samawati before also we have seen how allah subhanahu wa taala splits the samawat sky and also earth jala he made lakum for you min anfusikum from yourself allah made the spouse you know wa min al anam and then talking about see the azwaj is from zawj you know spouse he is making from the same creation he is not he didn't do like you know women and some animal or man some animal no we are from the same creation that's why this is also a rahma of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and anam azwaj for anam is cattle they have they to have the male female like how they are yazarukum it's from zara spreads creates everything fihi in it laysa it is not kama salil shay laysa kama kamislihi shayin there is nothing similar to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so this is laysa kamislihi shay nothing similar to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wa huwa samiul basir he listen and he sees these two attributes every time different attributes come in lahu maqalidu samawati wal ard again talking about samawat before it was like you know how it splits heaven and earth now it says maqalidu keys of samawat and earth keys of sky and the earth here comes the keys in some ayas it comes the treasure treasure of the sky and earth i have the references also but here yabsutu rizqa liman yasha this is the thing to whom he wants he give more rest more provision more sustenance liman yasha wa yaghdiru innahu and to whom he wants he give due measure limited you know we say hand to mouth that kind of innahu bi kulli shayin alim he is all know everything alim he has all the knowledge people may think oh i am working so hard but yaqdiru you know like limited measured but what if you know yabsudu like more yabsudu so here it may enlarge it may spread this is the measure of allah subhanahu wa taala we can only beg and ask allah subhanahu wa taala in worldly affairs we try up to a certain extent more than that we can't do like you know this thing you do you do this course you may get this this much you know but who will give the provision allah subhanahu wa taala he can do yabsutu he can do uh, yaqdir you we all want yabsutu we want more we want like you know a large spread risk here it says risk provision it can be tangible intangible it's a vast list liman yasha wa yaqdiruhu innahu bi kulli shay'in alim so till here we'll stop because Uh, we don't have much time ayah number 12 okay till ayah till ayah 12 <coughs> i'll just repeat from the starting so here this is a makki surah and here we in the starting it's from hamim ha, ha surahs and allah subhanahu wa taala mentioned how he did the wahi revelation sent the quran through the wahi and we all know 
Quran was revealed in 23 years and different kind of wahi like with the bell like ringing bell in the ears and you know it's very hard sometimes whenever the wahi comes it was very hard for Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam and there was no change even the haraka damma fatha kasa there was no change at all whatever mentioned 1400 years ago still the Quran is same mushaf is same and then here attributes of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Aziz and Hakim and later on Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says how he made heaven and earth how it splits and he is Ali and he is Azim and almost like uh, heaven will uh, split one sky but after that how the uh, angels are doing yastaghfiruna yusabbihuna they are doing praise and also yastaghfiruna and you know whenever you go for umrah you you go and you know do the tawaf they baitul mamur is the top of the kabakullah uh, baitul mamur baitul mamur there all the angels will be praising allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and they are moving a new batch of angels repeat nahi hote bar bar the angels are coming and doing the praising of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Same thing, it says in uh, the passage, they do a stuff for the, all the angels. They are built in for the doing the praising or stuff for. And then, you know, Allah ta'ala don't like giving um, credit to other people, saying supernatural, there is nothing supernatural. We can only convey the message. We can't say, okay, listen to me or we can't force. Because Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa can't force or we can't force anyone. And you know, Quran is in Arabic, which is the language what the, that time was. And then we all have to gather whether it's we going to go to Jannah or Jahannam. We all want to go to Jannah. And you know, and then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, if I want, I might have made one religion, but no. He has given us free will. And later on, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, I am not going to say if you take uh, wali other than me. No helper will be there. No close protecting friends. Subhanakallahumma bihamdika nashadu la ilaha illa ka nashtakhtaru 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 ka nashtakhta